We are back here with some more Mega Man 6. This is going to be the third leg, the penultimate leg of Dr. Wily's castle, which usually means we do the boss rush if our knowledge of previous games is to stand true. And, or not. Maybe, maybe it's something different. Maybe they're trying to innovate uh, with the series. Oh, whoa. Okay. Oh, cool. So it looks like th those fan things, they can either blow outward or they can suck inward. Okay. I like that. Fun little little gimmick there. Uh, we had a water-ish, uh, not even a stage, but like a water-ish portion of a stage earlier. <laughs> Whoa, cool. In 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 the game, kind of like this. I don't think this whole stage is gonna be water though. Going in the water with your oh god, with your jet armor is a lot of fun because you're just zipping around. Oh my god. Okay. Man. A little bit close here. Yeah. Okay, so we're probably done with the water from that point. Ooh, okay. I think, yeah, I can just stand in these corners and take them out one at a time. It's interesting, the one above me doesn't even want to fire. I guess I'm a little bit too far out of his field of view that he doesn't even think it's worth, <laughs> worth wasting a bullet on me. Worth wasting a lemon. Oh, okay, and we're... I guess this is the boss rush. Uh, yeah, they, they, they have been giving us a, a little bit of a stage right before the boss rush. Uh, okay, this is, uh, what's his name, Yamato Man? And as a reminder for the boss rush, I typically have no reservations using the special weapons. Uh, I think here we got the Tomahawk. Because, you know, I try to play pretty much the entire game with only Buster, but these bosses, you know, we've... We've already beaten them once with Buster only, so here, might as well just save ourselves the trouble, especially since we got a lot to do. Alright. Who's it gonna be? Who's next up? This is a uh, Plant Man. He has this weird shield barrier thing, right? And, uh, interestingly, it's not the fire weapon he's weak to, it's the ice weapon he's weak to, so kind of a, a Pokemon esque rock, paper, scissors. Man! This, this blizzard weapon sucks if you're... Okay, so I have to use it in the air, because if you're on the ground, it like, it, it lags, it, it holds you in place for a second, but it doesn't do that if you're in the air. Or it might, but obviously the, the result is not quite as noticeable if you're, if you're airborne. Alright, one or two more hits. There we go. So yeah, not the fire weapon, the ice weapon for Plant Man. I can't believe six games and didn't have a single plant man before. This is Nightman. So he's gonna be uh what's his one? His is the Not the Flash. It's the Spear? I think it's a spear. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The spear is so it's penetrating his shield, so I actually I don't have to wait for his for him to drop his shield, which is nice. Okay. Oh, okay. Almost trapped myself in a corner, and then I voluntarily trapped myself in a corner. That was nasty. This is a Centaur Man, the dude who annoyingly freezes you, making it pretty much impossible to no-hit this guy. Unless, I guess you have to have perfect, perfect positioning. Otherwise, you definitely can't do it. Okay. Man. Okay, that was bad. Uh, see, now I'm just... And it doesn't even like freeze you for like a split second. It literally freezes you until you get hit. Or like right before you're about to get hit. But good freaking riddance there. Okay, halfway through. This is a uh, wind man. I think yeah. Okay, so he's the guy that we can use the flash on, which is the most ridiculous weapon because it just I think it just damages the entire screen. Yeah, <laughs> it doesn't matter where he is. It just okay. This is silly. Oh my god, he's still able to hit me even though I have, a, I have the cheapest weapon of all time. Uh, okay. Boom. That's cool how he just, boom, explodes. Like you're not even facing him, you're facing away from him. <laughs> okay. Tomahawk man. So, okay, he is weak to the, um, the barrier. We actually gotta be like up close to him. It would be uh oh my 
god, I'm just taking hella damage. Oh my god, alright. That was pretty bad. Pretty bad. It would be nice if you could throw the barrier, like the Leaf Shield in Super Smash Bros, but... I'd probably make it too powerful, right? Okay, this is a flame, fire, some fire weapon man. And <laughs> he's, uh, he's weak to the wind weapon thing, because we don't have a water weapon in this game. Oh, he has those, uh, flame pillars that I... I forgot to deal with those guys. I think I just have the space... I forgot the spacing for that, though. I think it's, like, a little bit less than half the screen away. Eh, who cares? We don't, that's for sure. <laughs> Alright. Jump over here. Okay, last one. All right, he's this is a uh, Ice Man, Blizzard Man, Snowball Man. He's of course weak to the fire weapon. And this fire weapon, I think it, it, it's pretty shitty. It has like a really short range. It like barely goes like a fifth of the screen, if even that. So we gotta be kind of close. Otherwise, it'll just leave like yeah, it'll do that. It'll like leave a fire pillar behind. I'm taking a ridiculous amount of damage. Bye. Go away. Alright man, that is uh That is the third leg. So we'll pick it up uh here. Let's switch back. We'll pick it up here next time with more Mega Man 6.